Hello, everyone. Welcome back for another episode of Resident Evil Umbrella Chronicles. This is... I can't remember what part it is, but I'll post it. It'll be posted. I think it's Anyways, part five. It's part five. Five-time WCW champion, Ron Moore, joining yep. us. Once again, Resident ECW. And Wesker's back. But the question is, whose side is he on? Yeah. Wesker. Well, he ain't the facility. No more. Is this Goldeneye? Oh, wait. <laughs> it feels like it. Dang, <laughs> dang, does it. So, Wesker took some kind of weird virus that brought him back to life with superpowers. I'm not sure if that's good or bad. That's probably bad. And yeah, someone. The mansion. Uh, so, uh, a friend of mine at work that's playing Resident Evil 2 Remake, he explained how. Mm -hmm. Wesker came back to life because I was like, really? Oh, okay. He has like some sort of a vaccine or serum or whatever it's called. Exactly. Yeah, because I forgot what it was. I think originally he was supposed to stay dead, but like people wanted him to come back and then they just made a way for him to come back. They're like, all right, fine. We'll, we'll think of some crazy way that he comes back or whatever. Yeah. But originally he was supposed to stay dead. Uh oh. So Wesker's flying solo. He's no longer with stars, or he's no longer with Umbrella. So he says, "My lady, who is he referring to?" Um, that's a good question. I think uh, he's talking about the computer or whatever, because I guess he tried to get some of the data or whatever from Umbrella, and unfortunately, it locked him out. So he just, yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's not Otacon. He's not a hacker. No, nah, he's definitely not. He's got a big bug problem right here, though. Yeah. Now, what is this? Uh, super Troopers? Or no, Super Troopers. Um, Starship Troopers, where we fight a bunch of bugs. Oh, man. I really. I just watched that the other day. Oh, my God. This game truly does have a lot of bugs in it. Oh, man. See how many people get those references. More bugs than, than Ocarina of Time. Ooh, dang. Oh, no. Mad Kermit the Frog. <laughs> Uh, Kermit turn heel. Yeah, I'm gonna kill you. Exactly. Now the thing I like about Wesker's campaign is really champ. It's really challenging, but it's also kind of short at the same. For the but it's it really, as far as it goes or whatever. This is like among one of the harder ones. As you can tell, his campaign. Damage, like, oh, he's gonna run for president in 2020. He's running for president. Yeah, <laughs> President Wesker. Who, who's his oh, running mate? Uh, that's a good question. I, th I guess it'd be that one guy or whatever, William Birkin or whatever that he worked with or whatever with Umbrella. Oh, yeah. Or it could be, who knows? The it Tyrant. Hulk Hogan for all we know. Oh, the Tyrant. Oh, man. Who would Wesker's be just got a fly swatter? Who would be the secretary of ECW? Oh, uh, I don't know. WWF light heavyweight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's gonna be like, what? <laughs> oh no, we got super mad red zombies coming after us. Yeah. I'm gonna assault them with my assault shotgun. As Jeff would say, this game would have been better if it was on. No. The Dreamcast. Whoa. Whoa. Where, where did they come from? Yeah. Someone opened that door. I just told you guys, don't open that door. Yeah, he sounded like the paperboy from the movie Paperboy. Oh, dang. Johnny, I think's his name. <laughs> I just remember the AVGN uh, Paperboy uh, video. <laughs> yeah, I, when I first seen that movie air on TV, I thought it was, I was like, wait, they made a movie of the video game? <laughs> but no. I thought the same thing too, people. That's all. Don't feel bad. I thought the same thing too. I don't want to be a bad boy! But this just then, this commentary sucks. Uh, That's mostly on my end. That's probably why. In this edition of SC2K, we're commentating over Resident ECW on Brother Chronicles. We play as Whisker. Whisker. Yeah. Rebecca. 
with two with three C's. No, Rebecca, <laughs> yeah. Rebecca. I knew a girl named Becca, and she said the postman knocked on the door, saying, "Yes, I have a package." No, her name was Becca, and he goes, "I have a pack package for Becca." <laughs> she goes, she "Oh, that's known. Becca, sir." Jeez, a bunch of dead bodies. Okay. I hope you survive long enough for us to have our tear well, if you got all the ammo, infinite ammo, then yeah, you should be pretty good. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody said you have to do like a ridiculous thing or whatever to unlock infinite ammo for all guns. And then goes, you got to beat all the campaigns with the S ranking, which I haven't done. And then you're supposed to find like a bunch of like hidden files, which I haven't done, not gonna lie. I was like, yeah, that's too much work for me to unlock infinite ammo. I think I'm good. Yeah, the pet It's a ridiculous thing. Ca campaign mode? In the campaign mode, where you run for president. Champagne mode? Oh. Yeah, let's play campaign 84 live stream on the uh, Coleco Vision or wherever, in television, wherever it was on. Coming soon to do it live. Yeah. Do it live. You. I thought we disposed of you. Oh no. Yeah, what the heck is that? I honestly couldn't tell you. Ah, uh, well, its name is called Lisa or whatever. It's like some kind of. Not even you. Lisa. Looks like a Ocarina of Time been... Shadow Temple enemy. Oh. Maybe. Ooh, maybe Capcom copy that from them. Yeah. Yeah. It's come out the no, never mind. I'm an idiot. This ain't come out the same year as Ocarina of no, Time. I'm thinking of Resident Evil 2, the original. Oh man, uh, I forgot when Umbrella Chronicles came out. I think 2007. So yeah. this game's like what, 12 years old? Yeah. Do 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 do. Oh, scab. Scab. Yeah. So like all this hidden stuff you find, and you got to get S ranks. I'm like, at this point, I'm like, nah. I already suck enough at this game. There's no way I'm gonna get infinite ammo. <laughs> the exit should be close. The hourglass. The exit should be close. Pick up the pace. And back at the mansion, back where we started. Well, no, Wes, please don't open that door. Yeah, Jill Valentine's Day is around the corner. No oh, Jill Valentine's Day 2019, 2020, 2055, whatever. <laughs> 2055! Oh, is this the original mansion? Yep, we're just taking another quick tour of the mansion before it blows up. I wonder which mansion is cooler, this mansion or the Villa Mansion in Castlevania 64? Oh, uh, that's a good question. That, that'll that be for the audience to decide. I personally prefer Villa. Mm, I, I oh. do too. Hey, might as well use it. You just wasted the rocket launcher. Why? Yeah. Why, Why not? Hey, you know what, Ernest? You need to get better at this game. You need to play it like a man and... You know, if you use this, you can actually get past the level. You need to just use the handgun. I'm not going to just use the handgun. What's the <laughs> whole point of grabbing all those other weapons? Use the heck. <laughs> Ernest, why don't you use the handgun yourself? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. No, this ain't deja vu. It's Groundhog Day. No, that already <laughs> passed. No, it's Rusev Day. Oh, exactly. No! My door! No! Don't go! My, like, all-time favorite line in Resident Evil. Ow? Yeah. The director of that, or whatever, he's like, Oh, that's pretty good. You know what? You don't need to do it anymore. His first take. No! Don't go! Alright, that's, that's about as good as it's gonna get. Alright, we'll just use that take. I have to say my favorite take is, uh, you almost became a Jill sandwich. You know, I want to know who wrote the script for that. There, who must have thought, you know, I don't know. 
They yeah. must have been trolling us. They're like, oh, this sounds so ridiculous that people are going to be just like, what are... I don't know. You're right. <laughs> it's like, why? Why would anybody say that? Not me. Not me! <laughs> you did this to us, Kermit! Yeah, I read a news article online where uh, this woman had to step down as uh, whatever job she had with the city because she kept on going around, going around randomly licking people. Uh, and I'm like, well, what is this, Resident Evil? <laughs> was she a licker? What the heck, man? That's weird. That's her, that's her favorite enemy from the game. What's your favorite enemy? Licker? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Playing a little bit too much of the remake, and she just probably thought she was a licker. I don't know. Oh, boy. I think somebody told me originally, too, that I forget, like, zombies, they could turn into, like, these other zombies called Crimson Heads, where they get faster, they run at you. And oh. then those crimson head zombies actually could turn into liquors. So like the zombie, like I don't know, has three stages of evolution or something. I don't know. That's well, what I've heard, but I'm not sure if it's true. Those three stages of evolution is a mystery. Yep. The line in the sand. Oh, line. we just got a copyright strike. I'm joking. Oh dang it. Oh. Like use the rocket launcher. Yeah. Imagine James Bond. In this game, the, the Golden Eye James Bond in this game, do him a, uh, a mod where he's in this game and using his all the guns from Golden Eye in this game. They'd be pretty cool. I'm surprised somebody hasn't done that. They probably have because you never know. Yeah. In the game, we probably would have heard about it. it. Oh yeah, like Super Mario crossover, cross dresser. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or what was the mod? Uh. Uh, Castlevania Doom. Oh, that's pretty cool. I heard about that one. Man, forget well, this. I want. I want to play Gloom. Oh. Oh, it's Robert Michael Burhan or Michael Robert Burhan. Oh. It was no, zombie. Right. Zombie <laughs> Burhan. Somebody get Wesker a towel so he can wipe off all that blood. Yeah. Oh, and here comes our number one stalker. Yeah. It appears to be stalking me. Your desire for eternal slumber. It's like, yeah, get away from me. It's like, ow. Yeah. It's like, shoot, shoot, and shoot some more. And jump. Wow, Wesker should have tried out for the NBA. He jumps yeah. that high. Oh, might as well throw everything out of the book, the grenades. It's like, will this yeah. thing just die? Right. Come on. The end has come. Ow. You <laughs> can't tell me that didn't hurt. Nice. Insert, uh, what is it? The Price is Right losing song. Bum, 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 bum. No. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man, Wesker don't need a car. He'll just run. Oh. Insurance fraud. That's what that is. Yeah. And so I was reborn. Oh, uh, I don't know what happened to the house. It just blew up. All right. Well, here's a check for your for your house. A new yeah. horizon stretched out before me. Oh, and the only thing I gotta ask myself now is, what will happen next? Leaving nothing to oppose me. Uh, I didn't do as bad as I thought I would, but I didn't. Uh, that's not bad. Better than last time. Yeah, you made an A for effort. <laughs> How about an E for ECW? Oh, I'll take that. All right, guys. Yep. Thanks for joining us. We will see you guys next time. And like Ron Mar always says, I don't know. <laughs> Go for it. Well, ho hopefully uh, we won't get copyright strike for using Mexico's footage. Oh, wait. I hope not. It's my footage. Yeah. Imagine doing that. Actually doing that to us, just taking us down. No that, way. That's insurance fraud. I wonder fraud. if I could flag no. my own video and say, like, no, I'm going to flag myself. and be like, oh, how'd you get kicked off YouTube by flagging myself? I heard... Uh, 
that could happen. I think I don't know how it happened to Archfiend a while back or what, but I think I J Man might know it. more about that story. J Man is the man to ask. Yeah. Until next time, folks. All right, guys. God bless and take care.